<laughs> I've been thinking about straws quite a lot recently. It was the press uh, saying that the plastic ones have got to go by next year in Britain, I think it is. So this is a plastic straw. There's several things which will disappear, but there's quite a number of items, and I'll be showing some of them. Over the, over the videos, which uh, uh, work with paper straws, which will come back again, I suppose. But anyway, here's a little resume of a few straw things, some of which would work with paper, and others not so well. This one would work perfectly well with paper straws, actually. Um, it's because this bit here in the middle is plastic. It's uh, there's a straw. I've got some Ribena drink, which is um, a, a nice a nice fruit drink. But I've it's up to the camera, so if I can get close enough to you can see what happens to the wheels. When I when I start clicking in, hmm, quite a nice drink too. Yes, I like that. So that works still very well, and it would certainly work. All you're using is certain one at the top and bottom. It's a very old piece, so about 19, late 70s, I think this came out. There's a little thing for kids to be able to enhance their meal time when they're drinking. Good stuff. And another one which we we came out very recently, and in fact we had this in the Christmas pack, is this one here, which has got um it won't work fully because it's actually a light stick which is now used up but it's quite a sweet idea there's a little light stick inside which you activate by bending it so it lights up for about two hours or something there's this, a little crimping at the end of the string this has to be a plastic straw unfortunately crimp here and a crimp here let me just show the crimping effect and you can see that at the other end that can't get past the obstruction, but liquid can. So if I put this into my drink again, I'll be able to make this go up and down. Really? So I'm getting plenty of liquid in my mouth, but I'm not getting the, the, um, the light stick, thank goodness. I don't want to swallow that to the end of my drink. But it's very nice, that thing goes up and down and up and down each time you take a sip, or a little blow as well to push it back down again. There we are. So those were very popular, if so, they call them glow motion sticks or something that we put in the Christmas pack a few years ago. So that's one that would have to be disappear unfortunately, because I don't think you can do that um, crimping effect. I don't think you'll be able to do it with paper straws, which would be a pity, but well. Here's another one which will have to disappear, but it's very, very wacky, this, because it's not one that um, you drink with. I mean, you take off straws you can't drink with, and you turn them into a puppet. A little lady dancing like that. It's got tiny little plastic, plastic string here, going through the straws, up to the two arms, pull that hard, and her, her hand... And her hand's bending a bit now. Can you see the, the wrist bending like that? A bit of movement in that one there of the wrist. Oh, yes. So she has a good old dance with her hands. Not not, not with the legs. You can't get the, 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 the legs to dance, but you can get the hands and the... Oh, the hands gone behind the back there. It's a very, very sweet little idea, that, which I don't think I've ever seen before. And I've never seen it since. So something else you can do, but I'm saying with a plastic straw. Hard to see them doing that with a, with a, with a paper straw. And then there's a charming idea here, which I think, again, has to be... Oh, no, well, there's two more to do. This is one here, which is using the straw as a means of holding um, a sweet. In this case, sherbet. Instead of being in a package, to all its straws. Can you see the packaging? And that's the actual straw with one of the one of the many coloured ones with the top bit cut off now because it's all sealed in to make it hygienic. Inside that, when I shook it out, was a quite a pleasant little bit of sherbet sweet, you know, that powder which fizzes in the mouth slightly. And that's a nice way of packaging it though, in little plastic straws. So a good one that. Red is cherry, orange is orange, yet lemon is, is yellow, green is apple and salt. You know, they've got different different flavours to them. Very sweet. 
the last item to show is something here we put in the Christmas pack, which is something I'm going to be, feel very sorry about because it's this brilliant idea. This it's a little straw cutting device, which is absolutely brilliant. When you put a straw in there, out will come a coil. I'll see if I can. Well, I'll just show you what's going to happen when it's been done. It's going to turn into something like that, one of those, like that. Let's see if we can make it happen. I've got to turn it like that to get it started. And when I've done that, I then got to turn it with this thing, oops, like that. No, I need to do it the other side, I think. Let's try one more time. Uh, I see, like that, yes, like that. Turn like that, ooh. Now I've got to see if I can turn that and start turning it. No, it doesn't, I'll flip to the game. I haven't practiced this enough for years and years. Oh, perhaps it goes that way. Uh, 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 uh. I'm having trouble with this. Oh no, something, something's coming out. Ah, oh, there we are. Ah, it's chopped off. It's a weak straw, I think, but anyway, you'll eventually get some of that, which I think when you're really practiced, you can get really long pieces like that. That was a straw and I cut a few years ago. And that comes out of this extraordinary wacky world, that they call it. And I had a long chat with the guy at the New York Toy Fair a few years ago when he first introduced these. But it's, uh, and you can make them thicker and thinner. Can you see, you've got a very thick one there and by adjusting this thing here, you can make them have a much finer cut. So I've gone from a very thick, coarse cut to a much finer one, to a much finer one, to a much finer one. Very, very clever idea, that. So that's something that I shall be sorry to see the back of. So perhaps I'll come up with something here, which is not a drinking straw. Well, not intended to be a drinking straw, but still could be a bit of fun for kids. We'll see. Very versatile thing, the straw is. I'm looking forward to seeing what they're going to do with the different paper straws. Well, I've got a few more to show you anyway, and other videos, but um, there's a lot to that, it's more than just drinking, don't you think? <laughs>